Hey, what's up? It's time to feel alive. I'm back with some more of the catwalk. Uh, it's been a while since I played this, so, um, you know, I'm, I'm a little bit rusty. We're gonna do a quick team recap first. And obviously, we just got a badge, so we have a new team member in Miss Kerr, number two. Uh, let's get her on the layout. There she is. Looking real fine. Um, this, uh, I don't actually have a clip for because it's not mine. Um, this was given to me by my friend, Ed Dearman. See, it's got the original trainer there, Adrian. So, um, I traded him a, uh, a Berserker from a previous Nuzlocke that I did called Serka. He bred it and got this shiny Galarian Meow for me. And, uh, was basically the whole inspiration for this, uh, this playthrough, this shiny Catlock. So, um, yeah, we gotta use this thing. Have to, has to be done. It's got, uh, as you can see there, let's just quickly go back to that. It has really nice defensive stats, so, um, a good addition to the team. 84 defense, 71 special defense. I like it. Very happy with it. Stoked to be finally using it. But yeah, um, I, I missed a cutscene here. Uh, Sonya just talked to me with Yamper real quick. Uh, I wasn't recording when it happened, but whatever. We're gonna come up here. And do a cutscene with Bead. Mm -mm, I don't think you need to talk to Sonya there. I'm gonna open up my projector source so I can actually see what Bead says. Destroy it! Destroy it all! We're gonna find those wishing stars. Raja! <laughs> the smugness. We're gonna bring the champion more wishing stars. We want to please him. Raja, if you're truly the champion's Pokemon or the chairman's Pokemon, then you should feel grateful for this chance to help him find wishing stars. Oh yeah, you actually fight that couple Raja later, don't you? Oh my, you again. So you think you can start collecting wishing stars now that you're in cake you can get the champ's favor? That's the way of things, is it? I see. So you do have some kind of new. But I won't have it. I won't allow you to stand in my way. Oh, you do about to be dead. Uh, okay, okay. Bring it on then, bead. I, sh I should be okay. Psychic type versus psychic type. I might get a light screen up right off the bat, to be honest. Is this my meow stick with light screen? It is not. It's my one with reflect. Okay, not ideal. Um. Missing's level 32, I'm level 39 though, so, you know. Mittens. Dominate. Could have used Miss Kerr here. Oh, by the way, I have leveled up Miss Kerr to level 39. Just to save a bit of time. I don't have to grind and stuff. I just traded it to a different game and um, used a bunch of experience candies. Attack falls. Oh, you go for light stream. I see how it is. Well, I'm going to eat some physical attacks anyway, so it's fine. Darkest Lariat. Womp it. If this doesn't watch off, I'll be surprised. Whew. For a second, then I thought it wasn't gonna. <laughs> Oof, I've already seen more than enough to judge you at your team's abilities. You reckon? Leza grew to level 40. Let's go. Got a Vita. Cute. Pretty sure his got the tell? No. Gofarita, the baby form of it once uh, took out one of my last one ones. Not ideal. <laughs> the Darkest Lariat animation is amazing. <laughs> Just freaking mittens Beyblading. Uh, I'm probably gonna skip like all of the trainers in the forest. I don't think there's any need to like level up anymore for the fairy gym. Uh, obviously, Miss Kerr, being a steel type, gonna be very useful for the next gym. Sort of, uh, I think I've said this many times in this playthrough, but you know sort of um, adding the uh, shiny cats that I have to my team that are going to be really useful for the next gym. Because we have a very limited pool to choose from. Uh, I have to win this for gym, do you really think I'd be blah 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 blah? <laughs> blah 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 blah? Is this fairy type already? No, it's not. Bye. Just going to one shot all of your mom's name. Get out of my face. Feels good to finally be playing this again. I, um, I was really enjoying this playthrough, but then just, like, life got in the way, and I haven't been able to pick it up in ages, but I've got a bit of spare time now. Why not do it? It's, it's hard, though, because, like, most of the times that um, I have free time, I'm on a stream, and I haven't been playing this on stream, so it's like, eh. <laughs> Missed that dialogue. Never mind. But why? How could this be? How could someone like you get in my way? I was the one chosen to be by the chairman. I was the one who would just defeat the champion. Words. I'm one of the elites, someone who can shoulder the future of the Galar region. Challenge your bead. Challenge your bead. I 
wondered what you were up to when you asked the Borough Chairman Rose's uh, Cobraja. I can't believe you tried to use the Chairman's Pokemon to destroy a historical site. Who cares for some ancient ruin when the next thousand years are at stake? Did you stand in the path of Pokemon Symbol Beam or something? How do you expect to support the Chairman with that sort of thinking? What an absolute Pokemon par. <laughs> Young Bead. It pains me to say this, but I am truly disappointed. It's true that I am the one who found you back when you were all alone. I saw talent in you. You remind me a little bit of myself when I was young. That's why I sent you to training school, to give you a chance at success. Trying to destroy the mural part of Galar's history, you show no love towards Galar. You are clearly not worthy to challenge for the gym challenge. Damn. We'll decide what to do with you later. For now, you will turn to Hammerlock. Beef. Shook. You, you must be joking, right? You disqualify my, disqualify me from the gym challenge? You're the one who doors me. There are a hundred different ways we could sort this out. Why are you choosing the worst possible option? Challenge bead. I will be taking those wishing stars you have gathered. Ba -ba -ba. Are we good? Ah, something doesn't sound. A terrible shame, all of this. An absolute disaster. I never wish to see the lose challenges for this sort of reason. Yet we do what we must to keep things fair and sportsmanlike. Are we good here? You know, during one of the Bead's matches, I heard the announcer say that Bead has no family. Apparently, it was Rose who took Bead under his wing, and so Bead was battling for the chairman's sake. What an awful turn of events. I hope the neural survival of that. Crumble, crumble. This cutscene is so long. Oh my god! It's a big dog! This is a shiny catlock playthrough. I don't want to see no dogs. Oh. Never really thought about that. The fact that the um, mascots of this game are dogs and I'm doing a cat playthrough. Would have made much more sense to do a dog playthrough. Shrug. Ah, blink. Mm -mm. Brilliant town events, but the ruins have brought the light for us to see. What does this tell us about Glass Legends? Pokemon? A sword and shield? Right, more than any hero, there's these things that appear to Pokemon that stand out. Not just that, but those Pokemon appear to be holding a sword and shield as if they were using them. Anything else look interesting to you? Spam A. Oh, good observation. They were really two heroes, but what if they. Uh, well, if that's the case, there's only one statue at the Badoo drop in. Dogs. More than any statue or hero or tapestry, these ruins made in ancient times must show us the real truth. Which means. The sword is Pokemon. Yep, I was thinking the same thing. It seems like it's a point in history and the sword and the shield were combined that the two actual Pokemon treat as the same thing, but then what? They just fade from history? Two young heroes, the sword and the shield, were actually Pokemon, but why would the truth of these ruins be hidden within the stories that were depicted in the artwork? <sighs> <sighs> With your help, I really think we're we'll making a big discovery here. Thanks, I'll give you a couple of these. To, uh, so just keep giving it your best to the gym challenge, okay? I should be headed to Bowden Ella next. And I have no idea how to say that. Gave me some rise. Are we done? Finally. Man, I, I'm trying to read like the um, the dialogue super quickly, and that's what is making me like mess up all the words way more often than usual. There's so much freaking dialogue. Uh, let's go heal up quick. Okay, so I'm gonna try and just get through this forest without battling anyone. I'm pretty sure you can do that. The only encounters you get in here are exclamation marks, so let's skip the. So it's pretty easy. Big route. I don't know if anyone's going to use that. So come up here. And then out here. Look at that. Didn't have to touch any battles. Um, I'm pretty sure I can get Eviolite here. I think that um, Miss Kerr is going to evolve pretty quickly though. I think it's just level. I don't need like a specific move or anything like that. I have a feeling I remember like um, cancelling the evolution when I was leveling up. So let's get Miss Cutter out front. Anything else gonna be able to use Ibiolite? Nah, so let's not bother. Let's find an item for her real quick. Okay, so gave Miss Cutter a um, rocky helmet. Oh, challenges Sam. Oh wait, she's like Cockney. Oh god. Look, even Mopeko is wearing you. Wait, Mopeko, don't tell me you actually like Sam. Ugh. We've already had a serious battle with him. He's an opposing gym challenger. Guess it's time to do it. Look, just take one of these lead cards, okay? You got Marty's Louis card. Nice. What's with that look, huh? That just means I'll think of you as my rival from now on, okay? There aren't too many gym challenges left, you know? So we're meeting in the finals. You got that? I'm gonna destroy you. Not even in the final. 
Let's go. Don't take that out of context, thank you. <laughs> Time to challenge the gym, yeah, let's go. We should have a Berserker by the end of this like first couple battles, I hope. I might have a red candy that I can just chuck on it. But I, um, just before the first battle, I'm gonna check how much experience we need for Miska to level up. What's your name again? Opal. Ah, there you are, my dear Jim Challenger. Thought you were, though you were really lacking in the color pink. See, I'm looking for a successor to take the model of Jimmy here. So my gym machine serves as an addition for sorts too. Oh, don't worry, it's simple enough. All you need to do is battle my trainers and answer the questions they ask along the way. Think carefully before answering your child. If you get the wrong answer, the stats of your Pokemon will get lowered. Oh, but if you answer correctly, your Pokemon will get a stat boost. Just think of it as a little fairy type Pokemon magic to make things interesting. Now, I want you to go on out. Show me what you can do. All right. Gamma face. We good? Now let the gym challenge begin. Gym mission. Battle of all your skill. Cool. Um, Pokemon, quickly in this curve. Let's have a look. What you seeing? All right, yeah, we should have a Berserker for uh, Opal. Here's where I'm putting my foot in my mouth this whole time and um, freaking uh, we need some other item for Berserker to evolve on this curve. All right, okay, it's time to start your audition to see if you're working to become the fairy type. Wait, is this Opal talking? I don't know. I don't even know. Just have to double check. I was definitely recording then. Is your chat trying that? I met Spritzy, one of the worst Pokemon in existence. Well, Spritzy's not too bad. Aromatisse, though. Terrible one. I love Shiny Miss Kerr. Uh, the... The fact that it gets like Meowth's color scheme, so good. But it's super. Oh, we're getting attack boost as well. Pog. We resist Psychic, I think. Yeah, we do. Question. Do you know Fairy Type's weakness? Yeah, both of these. <laughs> we boost in my attack again. And, oh, mate. Plus two special attack right now. Let's just slash. 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 Ooh, I'm thinking we're gonna get the evolution after this battle. Slurper. Don't really rate you either, to be honest. Get Metal Clawed. Energy Ball, you got speed. Oh, I'm guessing um, I've got good defenses, but I've got low speed. Metal Clawed. Yeah, you're gone. Plus two attack. You, you know, there's no way you're gonna survive that. Go on, Berserker. I mean,. Keep calling a Meowth Berserker. Once learned Metal Sound, doesn't really work for a physical attacker, but it could work for someone else. Nah, I'm gonna keep that. I've got Screech already, so like, why bother? Come on, evolve, 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 evolve. Do the thing, do the thing. Yes, all right. Look at that. I'm gonna do a layout change as well, real quick. Come on, five. Browse. Berserker. There we go. Bit too big for your ball there, bud. Look at that. That's a great shiny. I love the brown. Looks great. Uh, what appeared to be an iron helmet is actually a hardened hair. Pokemon lives for the thrill of battle. What's sick on? What's that iron head? Um, yeah. Is this 100% accurate? It is 80 damage and flinch chance. Oh, yeah, let's get rid of that. I know it gives me an attack boost, but I've already got Screech, so I'm happy with that. Looking good. Yeah, we should be able to just breeze through this gym. No idea what Opal's like levels are, but I think level 40 is going to be fine for this. Like, surely. I know we haven't like leveled up since the last gym, but still. I was pretty overleveled for that, if I remember correctly. <laughs> Shwirlix, and bring it on. I'm quite far away from the mic today. I don't know like how good the mic level is. I can see it like registering. Maybe I'll turn the, the music down just a little bit. Just a tad. Fight and Iron Head. I know I have a uh, fake out, but is there any point? Ooh. Such a sick shiny. I'm loving it. Um, 
worst Pokemon in existence. What was the previous trainer's name? I was just spamming it. Don't lower my attack, please. My speed. Okay, I was probably already going to be outsped by this thing. Never mind. I was completely wrong. <laughs> Oops. I really want to check uh, Miss Kerr's stats real quick. Oh, by the way, it's Miss Kerr 2, because I think Ed hatched uh, two shiny, shiny mutes, shiny Galarian Meowths. I'm next. I think you might have what it takes to become a very tight gym leader. Okay. I'll check the stats in this battle. <laughs> Let me just turn down the sound a little bit more, just so that I'm a little bit more audible. Hopefully it hasn't been too bad up until now. Uh, I'm going to fake you out. Clap. Oh, mate, that fake out damage. And he got the... Oh, yeah. I was about to say, he got the flinch, but it always gets the flinch. You eat omelets. Prefer cheese omelets. Oh, mate, I'm hungry now. Huh. I always thought that it was Opal asking those questions, but I just saw her mouth move. So I think it's actually the trainers that are asking the questions. I've never paid attention to that bit before. The tiniest bit of health. Um, still haven't checked uh, Miss Kerr's stats yet. Miss Kerr leveling up. God of War. Alright, let's have a look. What are we working with? You have 105 attack, 122 defense. My special defense is still pretty good. Uh, special attack and um, speed are pretty low, but that's fine. I love that defense stat though. Not ideal in this gym, but it will definitely come in handy. Iron Head, Womp. Miss Kerr. You'll love to see it. Everyone looking nice and leveled up. This is good. Good stuff. I'm really thinking that I'm just gonna go for the um go for the uh the sweep with Miss Kerr. Just gonna come in and dominate. That's my plan. Alright, Opal, we're coming for you. <laughs> Let's heal up, just to be sure. Super potion. Give me that. Cool. Alright, let's do it. Yeah, I'm going for it. Like, I've never had an issue with Opal's gym. I always just get the boosts and then just destroy her. <laughs> Is there anything that I can get? I mean, I could get the um, the speed boosts from um, using my normal moves, I guess. Or lower her speed a bit. Oh, that's pointless, because I'm just going to destroy the ones that I, the speed that I lower, so... I was a bit late to introduce myself, but I'm Opal Jimmy. I've got a good look at how you handle those quizzes. And why am I talking in a normal voice? I always do this. The last part of the mission is me. Let me have a look at how you and your partner Pokemon behave. later. Okay, let's go. You're challenged by Jinder Opal. I will destroy you. Wheezing! Wheezing! I actually have a button I could press right now that would make a wheezing sound, but I don't want to do it. <laughs> I kind of want to do it. I don't know how loud this is going to be. <laughs> not sure if that actually played or not, but there you go. Shall I fake it out? Why not? Can't hurt. Bit of extra damage at the start. Flinched and couldn't move. Question. Do you know my nickname? The magic user, the wizard. I think she's the magic... No, I feel like she's the wizard. Yeah. I almost didn't go for that because I thought like a wizard was um, a man. What, what row shot we then? I completely missed it. <laughs> Oops. I think it was my attack, right? By wheezing. Alright, level 36, I'm level 41. Yeah, we're doing good so far. 
more wild. Steel Berry. Not the ideal uh, type combination here. Ah, lower my attack as well. That is not ideal. Right, let's switch into Mittens. We can buy a bang this thing. What's it gonna have? Steel move, not gonna do much. Fairy moves, not gonna do much, we're good. Oh, I always forget how good freaking Incineroar Shiny is. Intimidate, oh yeah, I've got Intimidate as well. <laughs> nice. Iron Defense, ooh, well played, well played. I almost went for a Screech with um, Miss Kurt. We're gonna go for Fire Fang. See how much damage we can get off of this. Nice. Ah, okay, we're Iron Defense, we're good. Would have definitely killed if I hadn't Iron Defense on that first turn. Question. Where's my favorite color? It's purple. Yep. <laughs> Do -do -do. Raising my defenses. All right. Fire bang. Who's her ace? Oh, it's an Alcreamy. Eh, might as well. Uh, no. I'm neutral to fairy type because I'm half dark. Wants to send out Toby Kiss. Okay. Alright, let's swap into Miss Kerr. No, I don't want to swap into Lisa. Miss Kerr. And I'm wasting these boosts that my mom's are getting, but. Meh. This is how I want to play it. <laughs> it's just how I want to do. Go, Miss Kerr. Ancient Power. That's gonna. Do. Don't get the boost, please. Said good a bit earlier, but whatever. Bake out. Clap it. Clap. Flinched. Okay. Iron head. Air slash. Backslash. Question. Alrighty then. How old am I? Isn't it better to say 16? Yeah. <laughs> what do I get? Boost of speed, attack and special attack. Oh, mate, we're, we're gonna destroy you now. Uh, I'm gonna max steel strike. Does this lower? Yeah, lowers their speed. There's no point in me doing that. Let's boost my defense, because I can. Why not? <clears throat> I can't remember if I've said this in the series or not yet, but there's actually a way to um, play through Sword and Shield without ever seeing a, um, a Dynamax Mon, I think. Uh, you have to, it uses like a red card. You basically like make the opponent switch with a slower mon and then with, with the red card and then when their their mon comes out you can one shot them. I really want to try it. Cool kiss goes down. Alright. We got boost two plus two special attack, plus two special defense, and no, plus two attack, plus two special attack, and then plus two defense. Plus one defense, there we go. <laughs> I got there eventually. Level 38, pretty strong. But uh, you can't handle this. Are you prepared? I'm going to have some fun with this. Classic voice change halfway through. <laughs> I love that it's so heavy for a... Is it going to outspeed? I feel like Alcreen is pretty slow, right? I love the forest surrounding this gym, so sick. You lack pink. Here, let us give you some. It does outspeed. Yeah, we take that. We take that. Max Steel Sprite. Sprite is a word. Easy gym, easy life. That is another badge on the layout. Yes, I'm on it today. Badge five. Wait until she actually gives it to me. Then we'll make it visible. Give me the opal, bid defeated. Your pink is still lacking, but you're an excellent trainer with some excellent Pokemon. I still haven't done her voice properly like once. Mm -hmm. 
Well, good try. Not bad, not bad at all. Still not what I'm looking for. Oh, don't worry yourself about it, child. It's just a matter of my preference. I'll find the next gym leader elsewhere. In fact, I've got an idea about where to look. Too bad about the audition, but here's a very bad for your efforts. Uh, no, no, no. And we're on. Shing. I was a little bit early, but there it is. Five badges down, three to go. You can now catch Pokemon up to level 45. Take this TM with you too. A little bonus from this old lady. Draining Kiss. Can anything learn Draining Kiss? Oh yeah, my, my uh, Meow 6 can. Lastly, here's a little something for hearing me. There's my dad a little pink for you. Fairy uniform. Ain't wearing it. All right, get out of here. Of course, it's not good to neglect your elders, but old folk like me sure should also know when it's time to step out of the spotlight. Yeah, go on, off you go. You receive the TM. Churchester. To the ice gym. <laughs> Cutscene. Hold on now. I've got a few errands to run in Hammerlock. Could care to join me for the journey? If you're happy for the next gym stadium, you'll need to get to Hammerlock too, after all. With pleasure. They say two, two is company, after all. Uh, I'm not going to the ice gym, actually. I think this is Sword, so we're going to the rock gym. Probably my least favourite gym leader across both games. The rock gym guy. Gordy, isn't it? Hammerlock, always such a dusty town, though I suppose some Pokemon prefer it that way. Ooh, more cutscene. Just as I'm sorting out my green screen. Hmm. Come to gawk at me now that I've had my challenge ban taken away and my gym challenge status revoked. Can you really afford to waste time like this? Of course, but I suppose so. You no longer have to worry about catching up with me after all. I'll have you know though, I haven't given up. I must become the champion in order to help the chairman. I will go ask him to let me rejoin the gym challenge. I love this bit. Hmm, that boy. Mm. Now that's what I call pink. So sincere and straightforward and yet so twisted and misguided. I like it. That's the kind of thing that gives people some depth. I'm like me. I'm just an NPC to her. It's a blank face. Time for the gym mission, child. Huh? What? Pink. Pink. Pink! Congratulations, child! <laughs> it's jokes. We done? Miss Opal, what in the world has gotten into you? You were used by Oliana, am I right? Oh, well, this is Opal. You worked hard to gather the wishing stars for her, only to have her throw you away like rubbish once she was done with you. Come with me, child, I might be able to help you out. Of course, it all depends on how much hard work you're willing to put in, too. Are, are you testing me? Well, I accept. In fact, I plan on making sure all my full talents and tell me everything about the wishing stars. Wow, messed that up. But well for now, child, you should to Churchester. Yeah, I take it you know how to get to Route 7? Ugh.